Respect can be through good attitude, when you're kind to people, when you deal with them nicely. If you're a government official and someone comes to you in need of a paper to be signed, why the frown on your face? He's not begging you. He's not asking you for money. You're taking your salary because of him. So you should serve him like a real Muslim. But unfortunately, there aren't so many real Muslims. Rarely you will go into a government office or a department and you'll find someone meeting you with a big smile and asking you to sit down. Probably he would not even look at your face nor reply to your salam. And part of respecting people is to be humble, not to look down upon them. Part of respecting people is to know how to communicate with them. In the sense that learn how to listen more than you speak. Some wise man said once, Allah created two ears for us and one mouth so that we would hear more rather than speak. And it is part of good attitude is that you also do not interrupt people. So even if you know the point the one talking to you is about to say, don't interrupt him. Let him finish. This is part of respect. When you raise your voice, when speaking with someone else, this is lack of respect. Imam Ibn Taymiyyah says, may Allah have mercy on his soul, whoever raises his voice while speaking with others, anyone with intellect, and sound mind would know that this is a lack of respect.